So here we're going to draw the Lewis structure for this ion. So in O minus, let's bring in the steps for drawing Lewis structures. Count all of the valence electrons of all of the atoms. We have nitrogen and we have an oxygen atom. Nitrogen being in group 5A has five valence electrons. Oxygen has six valence electrons. Total that's 11, but we also have to add one valence electron because we have a charge of negative one. If the species is an ion, add an additional electron for each negative charge. So plus one is equal to 12 valence electrons. So the next thing we need to do is place one pair of electrons in each bond. This is a simple diatomic uh, uh, molecule, an ion, so there is no central atom. So we just place them here and connect them at least with a single bond to start. In this single bond is a bonding pair of electrons, two electrons, so we subtract two from our running total, which leaves us with 10. The next step is to complete the octets of the atoms. So let's complete the octet, octet for oxygen, two, four, six, and then here would be two more, so that's eight. So we've used six, so let's subtract six, four left. Let's see if we can place them here. 2, 4. Let's see if the octet of nitrogen is satisfied. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Oxygen does not have an octet. So because oxygen does not have an octet, our next step is to introduce multiple bonds. So if I erase a, a lone pair of electrons there and actually create a multiple bond, a double bond here, Let's see what happens. 2, 4, 6, 8. 2, 4, 6, 8. Both atoms are satisfied with an octet, and we still have 12 valence electrons placed. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12. The last thing to do is because this is an ion, I need to use brackets here and place my charge.